What just happened? Hi, today I'm going to be dyeing my hair on camera. I'm using Splat Midnight Indigo Rebellious Hair Color. Um, I'm using this because it's a hair dye meant for brunette, so I, I didn't really feel like bleaching this time, so this doesn't come with bleach because it's just meant to go on brown hair, gals. Guys, oh my god, I'm so nervous, first of all, because it's been years since I last dyed my hair. I used to dye my hair a lot in like 6th, 7th, I think it was like 7th and 8th grade. I used to dye my hair a ton, and then I took a long break after ninth grade where I had pink ends and now I have short hair which I've never dyed my whole head fully um, because I've been too scared to <laughs> so um, I've only done strips and ends and it's scary but now I have short hair so like I have no excuse I have to dye my whole head pretty much um, and also school is about to start so if you're someone who I meet in the future at my new school and I have just messed up hair, this might be because, <laughs> it might be because of this. So I'm going to show you like my whole setup here. So literally this is just old gloves I had from the last time I dyed my hair, which was long ago, and an old little comb brush thing, and I thought this might be handy, this little separator thing and mixer, but I don't, I'm not mixing color. This. I'm going to put conditioner in. I was going to before this. It's a feta cheese container. And then I forgot to do that before I started to film this. And then I know it seems a little extreme, but I put paper towel all along the edge because I'm going to be, like, dyeing my hair right here. So I didn't want it to get on the edge. I have, um, like, a bath towel on the floor. I got a different towel than the one I usually use for after I rinse it out. Um, that's dark blue because I'm dying my hair dark blue. I'm super nervous because most videos show it turning out black, but I already bought it and we'll just see how this goes. I'm wearing a shirt that I've had for a while. I love this shirt, but you know, I'm not too attached when it comes to like paint getting on some of my more loved clothes because I'm an artist so I get paint on my clothes all the time. And also this is an art store shirt from Blick Art Materials, um, so I thought it was suiting, you know? Okay, so let's get into it. <laughs> okay, so welcome to my little cute bathroom with leaves on the wall, the conditioner, and the little cup. It's This is to put like on my hairline and like neck. Essentially, I would like once my mom was done coloring it, we'd wrap it in tinfoil and put it up. But today, because no bleach and I'm lazy, I'm just going to put it in two buns on the top of my head. So, okay, I need to stop talking. And Trader Joe's tea tree oil shampoo or conditioner. It's like tea tree and eucalyptus, and I feel like, and peppermint, and I feel like it might burn my skin midway. Um, so I'm kind of stressed out about that. So we open up the package, and whoa, now my hands are all conditioning. Conditioner. Um, there we go. This is the container it comes in. It's actually pretty big. And usually this wouldn't be enough, but since I just cut my hair short recently, um, this looks like more than enough, so that's pretty good. And then they have this, which is the deep reconstruction um, conditioner, I think, that you use afterwards to like seal it in. They got some good old instructions, and I don't know, this is what an early life crisis looks like. My skin also, where I put the conditioner, feels really tingly, and I think it might not have been a great idea. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's scary, boys, because 
I just ate a whole pint of Ben and Jerry's. Some coconut oil, and I'm just gonna put that everywhere. Um, love, love. dropped all the towels into the bathtub. But I need to get a paper towel because I got some on the counter and I'm scared. <laughs> Anyways, back to our regular scheduled programming. I don't even know what I'm saying here. Everything I say right now is just a mix of like anxiety. No, it's just anxiety. <laughs> That's what you're hearing right now. Changes when in love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and one, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I just rinsed out my hair and it got everywhere. It sprayed all over the shower, all over the bathroom floor. It is all over my face. This, the whole thing, like I just had a little dot when I was dyeing the, like putting the actual dye in. Now my whole left ear is bright blue. 
But also, look at this color, it is actually super gorgeous. It's like, it looks really black, but it's like pretty blue. As you can see, my part is like bright blue. <laughs> Whoa. Um, my hands are blue, and like my hairline, I just finished taking off some. My whole face had blue running down it, and I can't show you, but my whole body has blue lines running down, like raindrops on a window, or like it looks like I, t I have a ton of blue veins. So that's not great, and I couldn't really get it fully out of my hair. Like, it kept running and running, so I just had to get out because my mom needed to use the shower. And I just finished, like, I got out and I just had to scrub the whole shower and it's still not all gone. I had to scrub the whole bathroom after I was done dyeing my hair, like, putting the dye in. And it's a mess. So, if you're looking to <laughs> use this hair dye, just know it's going to be a mess. And after I bought it, I had looked at reviews and it said it was going to be a mess. So, I was a little prepared but I wasn't prepared for how much of a mess this is. Like, my right here is not normally that blue. And I just don't know what to do. Okay, so it's the next day and my hair is looking fabulous. There's a lot of blue everywhere and it, in the course of like 10 minutes, it's going to, my face is going to be covered in blue. Um, like... Blue is just getting everywhere, everywhere I touch, everywhere my hair touches. I was, like, sleeping next to my boyfriend last night, and then he got blue all over his arm. Um, and it's a lot. It's really messy, but also I really like this color. It's very, blue. It's very like, black-blue, and I really like it. My hair is smooth. It doesn't feel fried from the dye because there's been no bleaching. And... If you're prepared for the mess, I do suggest this if you want this color, because from what I've seen, it gets the right color, like, very well. I really like it, and yeah, super happy with how it turned out. Remember, like, and subscribe for more, and comment down below if you have any questions or if you've used this hair dye and want to share your experience. Have a nice day.